Okay, now Samsung Galaxy phones do offer pretty good animations on its One UI. But there are many other OEMs, there are many other flagship phones like Pixel phones, iPhones, etc. offer much better animations on their UI. However, with the all new One UI 6.0, Samsung seems to have improved the animations further and made it look much, much better now. It feels good, it looks good, it's much better than the previous iterations of One UIs we have seen. Now, let me just show you the lock screen animation here. Now, uh, I have set the always on display on the lock screen here. Now, when I press the side key to light up the phone, you see the animation. So the transition effect is pretty good. Let me do this again. You see the animation on the always on display. As you can see, when I again tap on this button, the always on display just shrinks and sits back in the same position. And when I uh, try to unlock the phone or I tap on this button, you can see it zooms out. Uh, and the transition effect is pretty smooth over here. You see even the uh, the notifications just pop up from the bottom to the top. Let me do this again. Pretty good transition and animation effect here, isn't it? Now let me just unlock the phone. As you can see here, there is no animation when we unlock the phone. That is something which Samsung probably have to fix it. Uh, this is currently running on One UI 6.0 uh, beta. So maybe on the stable version, Samsung might add some animations to this. Now under fingerprints, we do have an option to show animation when unlocking. Though I have enabled this, I don't see the animation effect when I unlock the phone. This may be a bug or uh, this is something which Samsung will have to fix. Uh, we did see some cool animation happening when we uh, select that particular toggle and unlock the phone. It smoothly transitions into the home screen, which we are not able to see now. Now let's check out the notification panel or the quick panel. As you can see, there is a very smooth transition here as well. Let me swipe down from the uh, middle of the screen. You can see the uh, notifications, they uh, just move very smoothly. When I scroll up or down, uh, the movement is very, very smooth over here. And you can also see this bounce effect here. When I scroll up and down completely, uh, the notification panel bounces at the bottom as well as on the top. It looks pretty cool. Now let me do this again. It looks pretty cool, very smooth and a very nice looking animation that we have got. The transition effect is just amazing. Now let me press and hold on the home screen. For some reason, there is a delay here. When I press and hold on the home screen, it takes at least one second to get to this particular page. Uh, however, the uh, animation and transition is uh, pretty cool here as well. You can see it looks much better. But uh, I would prefer having a quick response when I press and hold on the home screen. This is again something which Samsung might want to consider fixing. Now let's go to settings. Let me scroll up and down here. You can see it is very, very smooth compared to the previous iterations of One UI. It moves very smoothly and slowly when I scroll up and down. Let me open any of the menus here. You see when I open a setting, uh, it just pops out from the bottom to the top. Let me do this again. You see it comes from the bottom to the top of the screen. And when I go back, it's a, a different effect. Uh, it horizontally swipes towards the left. Let me do this again. I'll go back. You see the page is uh, getting back to the original position horizontally. Now when I open this menu, it goes from bottom to the top. Vertically, it opens up. And when I go back, it opens up horizontally. Now this is the effect we have got on One UI 6.0. Let me open any other settings here. Let me open notifications. Again, goes from bottom to top. And when I go back, horizontally, it gets back to the previous page. Now let me open some applications and go back to the home screen. You can see it is very, very smooth here as well. It goes back to the same position where the app is located. Now let me uh, swipe up and open the recent screen. Again, there's a slight delay here when I swipe up. It instantly doesn't uh, show the recent screen. It takes at least uh, half a second. You see, it takes some time there. The response is not that good, I would say. Uh, it has to be quick. Maybe Samsung will have to fix this as well. Now uh, let me scroll towards the left. You see, it is pretty smooth. In fact, it is snappier. And if you want the smoother effect, you will have to move your fingers smoothly. You have to swipe it very, very smoothly or slowly uh, to uh, have that, uh, to see that smooth uh, you know, transition effect. And if you do it fast, it will quickly move around, which is pretty good. Now let me close these applications. As you can see, when I try to close the application, it, uh, the other application will come back to the, uh, this position and it looks pretty smooth. This is not something new, but it is smoother than before is what I can say. Let me just close all the applications. You see, it gets back to the home screen 
uh, very very smoothly and the effect is pretty good uh, what i'm trying to say here is the animations on one ui 6.0 has improved a lot uh, even though this is on the uh, beta the animations look pretty good this is uh, currently on the eighth beta i'm not sure whether we are going to get the uh, uh, get another beta before getting the stable release but it looks like it is uh, pretty stable and uh, the animations are good and there is no bug as such which i'm noticing right now uh, probably the next update is going to be the final one ui 6.0 stable uh, variant which we are going to get on the s23 series now uh, stay tuned for that video as soon as i get it i will uh, inform you guys and i have already made a bunch of videos about the new features that we have got on one ui 6.0 i have left the links for those videos in the description go ahead check them out and uh, if you're interested in this particular wallpaper i have left a link for this also in the description uh, and yeah uh, please do let me know what are your thoughts about the animations on one ui 6.0 do you feel it's better do you like it do you don't like it drop a comment share your thoughts and while you do that be sure you subscribe to the channel as well that's about it thanks for watching my name is salyan signing off cheers bye bye